operations on numbers divisibility numbers divisible by 2 have either 0 2 4 6 or 8 in their units place this is the divisibility test for 2 the last digit of the number has to be one of the following 0 2 4 6 or 8 is 75 divisible by 2 what is the number in the units place it is 5 so 75 is not divisible by 2 is 196 divisible by 2 what is the number in the units place it is 6 so 196 is divisible by 2 is 3872 divisible by 2 what is the number in the units place it is 2 this number is divisible by 2 is 643 divisible by 2 what is the number in the units place it is 3 so 643 is not divisible by 2 is 2420 divisible by 2 what is the number in the units place it is 0 this number is divisible by 2 this is the divisibility test for 5 the last digit of the number has to be one of the following 0 or 5 use the divisibility test for 5 and say whether these numbers are divisible by 5 is 75 divisible by 5 what is the number in the units place it is 5 so 75 is divisible by 5 is 190 divisible by 5 what is the number in the units place it is 0 this number is divisible by 5 is 2038 divisible by 5 what is the number in the units place it is 8 this number is not divisible by 5 is 643 divisible by 5 what is the number in the units place it is 3 this number is not divisible by 5 is 6985 divisible by 5 what is the number in the units place it is 5 this number is divisible by 5 numbers divisible by 10 have 0 in their units place Use the divisibility test for 10 and say whether these numbers are divisible by 10. Is 75 divisible by 10? What is the number in the units place? It is 5. So 75 is not divisible by 10. Is 190 divisible by 10? What is the number in the units place? It is 0. This number is divisible by 10. Is 2038 divisible by 10? What is the number in the units place? It is 8. This number is not divisible by 10. Is 6430 divisible by 10? What is the number in the units place? It is 0. This number is divisible by 10. Is 1982 divisible by 10? What is the number in the units place? It is 2. This number is not divisible by 10. Divisibility test for 3 So we can say that if the sum of the digits of a number is a multiple of 3, then the number itself is a multiple of 3. Is 75 divisible by 3? What is the sum of the digits? It is 12. 12 is a multiple of 3. So 75 is divisible by 3. Is 190 divisible by 3? What is the sum of the digits? It is 10. 10 is not a multiple of 3. This number is not divisible by 3. Divisibility test for 4. We have to check the last two digits. See the number in the tens place and the units place. Check if this two digit number is divisible by 4. If yes, then the whole number is divisible by 4. Check if 144 is divisible by 4. Last two digits are 44. 
When 44 is divided by 4, the remainder is 0. Therefore, is 144 divisible by 4? Yes! Check if 295 is divisible by 4. Last two digits are 95. When 95 is divided by 4, the remainder is not 0. Therefore, 295 is not divisible by 4. Divisibility test for 6. The last digit must be either 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. And the sum of all the digits of the number must be divisible by 3. Check if 64,218 is divisible by 6. Is the last digit either 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8? Yes. Is the sum of the digits divisible by 3? Yes. Therefore, 64,218 is divisible by 6. Check if 4,736 is divisible by 6. Is the last digit either 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8? Yes. Is the sum of the digits divisible by 3? No. Therefore, 4,736 is not divisible by 6. Check if 1,441 is divisible by 6. Is the last digit either 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8? No. Is the sum of the digits divisible by 3? Doesn't matter. Therefore, 1,441 is not divisible by 6. Divisibility test for 9 How do we find out if a number is divisible by 9? If the sum of all the digits of a number is divisible by 9, then we can say that the number is divisible by 9. Check if 261 is divisible by 9. What is the sum of the digits? 2 plus 6 plus 1 is equal to 9. Is it divisible by 9? Yes. Therefore, 261 is divisible by 9. Check if 5108 is divisible by 9. What is the sum of the digits? 5 plus 1 plus 0 plus 8 is equal to 14. Is it divisible by 9? No. Therefore, 5108 is not divisible by 9. Divisibility test for 11. Check if 935 is divisible by 11. Sum of odd places is equal to 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. Sum of even places is equal to 3. Difference between the sums is equal to 14 minus 3 is equal to 11. Is it 0 or divisible by 11? Yes. Is 935 divisible by 11? Yes. Check if 684 divisible by 11. Sum of odd places is equal to 6 plus 4 is equal to 10. Sum of even places is equal to 8. Difference between the sums is equal to 10 minus 8 is equal to 2. Is it 0 or divisible by 11? No. Is 684 divisible by 11? No. Divisibility test for 8. We have to check the last three digits. See the number in the hundreds, tens and units place. Check if this three-digit number is divisible by 8. If yes, then the whole number is divisible by 8. Check if 45,792 is divisible by 8. Last three digits are 792. When 792 is divided by 8, the remainder is 0. Therefore, is 45,792 divisible by 8? 
yes. Check if 45,796 is divisible by 8. Last three digits are 796. When 796 is divided by 8, the remainder is not 0. Therefore, is 45,796 divisible by 8? No. Divisibility test for 7. Check if 105 is divisible by 7. Double the unit's place is equal to 5 multiplied by 2 is equal to 10. Number formed by rest of the digits is equal to 10. Difference between them is equal to 10 minus 10 is equal to 0. Is it 0 or divisible by 7? Yes. Therefore, is 105 divisible by 7? Yes. Check if 315 is divisible by 7. Double the unit's place is equal to 5 multiplied by 2 is equal to 10. Number formed by rest of the digits is 31. Difference between them is equal to 31 minus 10 is equal to 21. Is it 0 or divisible by 7? Yes. Therefore, is 315 divisible by 7? Yes. Check if 442 is divisible by 7. Double the unit's place is equal to 2 multiplied by 2 is equal to 4. Number formed by rest of the digits is equal to 44. Difference between them is equal to 44 minus 4 is equal to 40. Is it 0 or divisible by 7? No. Therefore, is 442 divisible by 7? No. Rules of divisibility If a number is divisible by another number, then it is also divisible by each of the factors of that number. If a number is divisible by two co-prime numbers, then it is also divisible by their product. If two numbers are divisible by a number, then their sum is also divisible by that number. If two numbers are divisible by a number, then their difference is also divisible by that number. Which of these exactly divides 815? Check each option. The number is odd. So, it can't be divisible by 2, 8 and 4. Last digit is 5. So, it's divisible by 5. We can conclude that 315 is exactly divisible by 15 with the help of the test of divisibility of If a number is divisible by two numbers, then it is also divisible by their product. 15 is equal to 3 multiplied by 5. So, if the number is divisible by 3 and 5, this can be true. 777 is exactly divisible by 7. So, which alternative shows all the prime factors of 777? We have to find the prime factors of 777. Now, first let's find out the factors of 777. Those are 7 into 3 into 37. Now you can see that in the option number 2, all are prime numbers and those are the factors of 777. So, that is the correct option. In option 1, the number 111 is not prime. So, that cannot be the correct option. In option 3, the numbers 1 and 111 are not the prime numbers. And in option 4, the numbers 1 111 and 777 are not the prime numbers. And that gives the correct option that is option number 2. Now, let's move on to the next question. The number 3 hash dollar 6 is exactly divisible by 9. If hash 
is equal to dollar minus 1 then which digit can we replace hash with reverse check through the options option 1 hash is equal to 9 if hash is equal to 9 then dollar is equal to 10 sum of digits is equal to 9 plus 10 plus 9 is equal to 28 which is not divisible by 9 so this is not the correct option option 2 Hash is equal to 6. If hash is equal to 6, then dollar is equal to 7. Sum of digits is equal to 9 plus 7 plus 5 is equal to 21, which is not divisible by 9. So option 2 is not the option. Option 3. Hash is equal to 5. If hash is equal to 5, then dollar is equal to 6. Sum of digits is equal to 9 plus 6 plus 4 is equal to 19, which is not divisible by 9. So this is not the option. Option 4. Hash is equal to 4. If hash is equal to 4, then dollar is equal to 5. Sum of digits is equal to 9 plus 5 plus 4 is equal to 18, which is divisible by 9. So 4 is the option. All the digits in a six-digit number are the same. Which of these is its factor? If the digit is odd, 2 and 4 cannot be the factors of the number. If the digit is not 5, then 5 cannot be a factor. So, we are left with 3. Sum of the digits is equal to digit into 6. This will be divisible by 3. The numbers 23,573, 41,723, 30,613 and 12,463 are all divisible by? Check if all numbers are divisible by 3 by checking sum of the digits. 23,573 Sum of the digits is equal to 20, so no. That is also not divisible by 9. Now let's check for 11, as that test is quicker than the test for 7. 23,573. Alternate sums are 10 and 10, so divisible by 11. 41,723. Alternate sums are 14 and 3, so divisible by 11. 30,613. Alternate sums are 12 and 1, so divisible by 11. 12,463. Alternate sums are 8 and 8, so divisible by 11. So all four numbers are divisible by 11. This is our answer. If you like our videos, do share them and subscribe to our channel. If you want awesome quizzes, write to us. Keep watching and keep learning with Walnut.